Hey guys, John Loxy, you're back with our blind playthrough of Deus Ex. Let's see. Oh, uh, what am I doing? What am I doing there? I don't <laughs> just, uh, just adjusting the keyboard a little bit. Okay, so last time we left off, we got into the ocean lab. And... Did I go up here? No. No, I did not. Ah, uh, so we went out there, we kind of swam around a little bit. We basically tried swimming over there, seeing if there was another entrance. There is not. But there is something... over there, which I think you can get into... which we did get into by swimming. We're gonna kind of explore... What is that? Oh. All, all right. So this is glass, presumably, right? Baby Karkian. Okay, those are the Karkians. Can I, uh... All right. So these are windows. What is that? Is that a some kind of weapon? Probably a plasma gun, I guess. some kind of pool. Uh, and it looks like, I think that was a floating soldier, so there's a few Karkians. That was a soldier, right? Yeah, so presumably a lot of the... Um, presumably a lot of the soldiers, maybe all of them, are dead. Alright, so this is more of the same. Apparently we have to go up to the pool. Or at least go up to get into that thing. Which we may or may not want to do. What does that say? Neo... Karkarod? I hear... Uh, no, maybe that's the computers. Oh! Camera. Lead the way? They want me to do this? Are they behind me? Are they gonna... I mean, you know... It could just be like other games where the hero goes in and then the villains are just waiting for you outside, right? So there is the camera. I don't know where the actual security is. Now, what I was actually thinking of doing was going out there. There was that sealed uh, wing that I got into with um, where I swam. Okay, still don't see any... Uh, don't see any security... console. But I was thinking of going out there into the wing and, um, and grab... There's like a key. Which could be to those, I'm not sure. And... But let's go up first. There's doors on the side here. Talked about going to the northern wing, which... Oh, hello. So, there's a turret in there. Yes, there is. Can I just, uh, go log into that directly? What's over this way? How does it see me? There's no camera. Open it! Well, that wasn't super helpful. Uh... Okay... Camera status is off. Yeah, command center. Oh, there is one. Up somewhere. 
there we go, I suppose. Well. Right, it's there, but how does it... I didn't think it would see me, unless the camera from below sees me. How much damage did I take there? Was I totally green before? Like it did all that damage? That's a lot of damage. Well, in that case... I don't know if we necessarily want to go into here. But I do want to see what the soldier is carrying. Assault rifle. Don't fall into the kank... The... The kank? The tank, by mistake. That is... Probably a plasma weapon. And I don't need that, that's fine. Oh, no, we want to go up. Let's check out this room first. Command center. What was that, a candy bar? Okay, that's good. Some sodas. Oh. Dead uh, secretary model. And she's just, just dead. Nothing on her. I don't understand why the blood pools after you throw her back down. If I pick her up and throw her somewhere else, is there more blood? Yes. Let's connect the two pools of blood. <laughs> I don't know. Angelfish? Is that what those are? Or zebrafish? I can't remember. Oh, maybe you're only allowed... Oh. Maybe the blood goes away after some time, right? Because this one faded. So this one is sealed. This one is secure. Uh, hello, Manny. What are you, uh... What do you want? Your brother... Okay, your brother was in my lap, but now my lap is free if you wanna... You wanna get there. You need to... Choose. Choose and perish, Manny. Okay. Well, well, come on. Come on, then. In the lap. No, you don't want to... Dick. <laughs> well, fine, then. Fine. Oh, you're still looking at my lap, so you are going to come over here after all? All right. There he goes. Okay, well, lay down, then. Now you're getting back up near the microphone? Would you... Excuse me, my cat. If you, I don't want you sitting right there. <sighs> All right, fine. I'll just, uh, cause I just, I just fed them, and then he wanted treats afterwards, so I gave him the treats, and then he wanted more treats, and I was like, no. Now where are you going, weirdo? You gonna get up there? That's fine. Okay, good job. Well, so this must be the north wing. What was shooting there? Someone's shooting at the window or something. A turret, perhaps? Something about the north wing. See, this is weird. Maybe that's the... Maybe that's the, um, where the, the key was. So I would like to go out there and go get that key. Um, all right, so I'm thinking I could put some points into swimming. I know it's silly. Swimming speed and lung capacity of an agent increases slightly. I mean, let's, let's upgrade swimming just once. Okay. Yay. So, I can move faster and hold and the, the oxygen gauge is, is bigger or lasts longer or whatever. Um, so, I'm thinking I swim out there, get basically out of stuff, and then use the rebreather. Aqualung, okay. It does seem a little bit faster. And yeah, I guess that seems 
higher. It doesn't look like anything's over that way. Yeesh, that's right, the... Fair enough. Um, yeah, okay. Hang on. Uh, yeah, okay. Use. And then we'll turn off this. Deactivate. Uh, grab the mod. Oh, well, never mind. Okay. And then, yep, gun. Okay. Anything on the body? Bioelectric cell. Well, I'm not coming back here, so... Got a biocell. Wait, where am I? Crap, I'm getting turned around. And what is this? Doesn't matter. Let's go. Let's go. And I doubt there's entrances over there. There might be. But that would actually be pretty awesome if there was, but we're not gonna check. Did I check? I might have checked. Right. Rebreather power supply used up. Well, I'd say that was a good use of it. Got a uh, list of keys. Storage access key. You know, that'll be helpful, I assume. I could probably blow the door, but it's very possible that... Uh, well, who knows? Okay, so now... Right, let's check this area out. Okay, that's sealed. Oh, hello. Mary Beth, I've got fires going up all over the place and I don't know if I'll be able to put them all out. This is getting serious. Security locks have failed on the containment pens and a bunch of the cameras don't seem to be don't seem to be functioning, so there's no way to track any escaped animals. They did say something about stuff would not work as you expect, which actually makes sense with the turret now. The turret just went after me. I just got a call. The turrets on the command level went active and started shooting everything in the room. There we go. I'm way over my head and I can't even raise you or anyone else on the horn. I'm going down into the UC lab, so look for me there if you get this note. Yushio. Okay, this is also sealed, so you have to go up. Whoa! Right on. What about you? Do you want to fight me? Well, that works. That's a baby Karkin. Well, I guess we'll grab the uh, plasma rifle. All right. So we are full on ammo, apparently. Or, you know, I don't actually know. Maybe if you already have it, it turns it into ammo. So regardless, it looks like this is the only way forward. Let's uh, indulge our, our uh, scavenger fetish. I don't know what you'd call that. We gotta check the computer too. Nope, not you. The mouse is still, still super sensitive. Okay, personal computer terminal. I don't know if we've gotten anything from that, or for that, any... Uh, let's see, malfunctioning turret. Got a turret down here in the lab, not responding to any kind of input. I've tried running diagnostics, no response. Anything you can do from your end, otherwise I'll have to dismantle it. Illumination is a hand. You've been in the service of the false ones, those who call themselves majestic, but have so little understanding of the true doctrine of the mighty. Fortunate you will not be able to comprehend the plan, the way, course has been carefully laid out over a thousand years. I truly wish you could see the beauty of everything has been shown to me, and then you would understand why it must undertake such extreme measures. Illumination. Talking about Illuminati? Um, I didn't see who it was from. 
we'll check that out in a minute. Um, now, the other thing is Helios... I, I don't know if I brought this up before, but maybe Helios is actually organic, right? Because it, it has an eyeball, and now there's, like, flesh around it and stuff. And it seems to have a more human-sounding voice. At first, it sounded like the Overmind from, you know, StarCraft, but now it sounds more human. Uh, so I wonder if it's like, if it is organic, is it aliens? Because they're they've shown that there's aliens. From I Ridley. Uh, by the time you receive this message, it will already be too late. The computer virus will have been released. But now the entire network has been thoroughly infiltrated. I'm sorry. The only comfort I can give is that your necessary sacrifice will be for a higher cause. Interesting. Two MB Haggerty. Who is that? Well. All right, so there's probably a turret over here then. Oh. Yes, there is. I don't need to crouch because it sees me immediately. Um, can I blow it up? I guess that would be my my choice. I could use an EMP grenade. And there's stairs or something, so. Problem is, I don't know... Temporarily disable all electronics. I don't know if it'll come back. That's the problem. Let's try it, and then if it starts to shoot me... Uh, you know what? Let's save first. That way, if it all of a sudden turns on in the middle and, and shoots me to death... Uh, turret... Guard... That way, I'll have a save game. Okay, got myself a little EMP grenade. Run. Okay, it seems to be... Well... Okay, well, there you go. Oh, you. Well, let's... Wow, really? It aims for center mass. Rockets it is. Or regular grenades. Uh, let's do regular grenades. It worked. It destroyed the... the guy. So... You know, destroyed his body, which is a shame because he probably had stuff on him, but at least it didn't get rid of the key. Greasel Laboratory Key. We saw that in. Hmm. Is that the Greasel Lab, do you think? We saw the Greasel Lab in one of the cameras. Alright. Oh, hey, flares. Which, I mean, I don't... Oh, multi-tool. I'll take you. Take, if I can, click on it. Metal crate. Soy food. Definitely want to eat all the soy. Hmm. So, bioelectric cell. And two of them, actually. And a f bunch of flares and a fire extinguisher. Now, uh, Carson mentioned that you can use the pepper spray while crouching to get through lasers, which I assume means that they won't detect you if you're spraying while you go through them. I have no idea if that's legit. I mean, it could be a troll, which would be hilarious, but <laughs> but it would only troll me once. So, you know, it, it also might actually work which would be a weird a weird thing like it dissipates like you shoot it into the beam and it dissipates the beam and that'll let you go through if that's the case the fire extinguisher actually might do the same thing all right so what is this nano key ring got it but what this has to be the storage 
Right, okay, so... Oh, and there's another rebreather. Right on. Got ammo. Plasma. Already have enough. Already have enough. Yeah, I don't really use a lot of ammo. To be fair, I, I hoard everything, so I don't really use a lot of stuff. And uh, honestly, that rebreather might come in handy. I mean, this whole area is underwater. I still might need it. <coughs> so for now, let's do that. And you could probably also maybe hide behind the metal crate. Can I not walk? The okay. As far as like, or, you know, or maybe just run past the, the turret. Now this is locked. Oh, that's what you need. This is the Greasel lab, potentially. Alright, so I believe they are... There's one. Um... I think my best bet is... We'll save over this. Maybe I can sneak up behind it and just chop it. That's not the only one. It sounds like there might be a turret. Okay, there's that one. Is that the only one? Wait, where'd it go? Well... Yeah. Lightsaber for the win. Okay, what about you? There might be some in here still. Can I shut the pens? Do I want to peek inside? I don't know. I mean, okay, so let me rephrase. The answer is yes, I do want to peek inside because I'm curious. And the whole curiosity killed the cat thing. And there's... What's going on, Manny? And there's water down there, which seems... Well... I'm like holding my breath. There was bones in one of those, like human bones. Resale lab. Why did they... So I guess they... In a couple of them, were they fed humans or did they pull the humans into there and to eat them? Okay. I feel kind of, kind of relieved there's no more. But that means there was eight. Now are... I can hear them. I assume that was a Greasel. It could be a Karkian. Uh, now I've killed two. I think I saw a body of one somewhere else. So... I ask... Yes. Yes. And of course... Mmm. I don't like you. Okay. This area is flooded, of course. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, that's the thing I heard. Uh-oh. Does that mean it sees me? Yes. Maybe I should shoot it? Oh, Jesus! Um, wait, I can't... Am I... Do I have my weapon out? What? I mean, I must, but... Uh, shit. Is it dead? No. Wait, am I still gonna... Um... Hmm. Okay. Not... I mean, you know. I, I wasn't... Maybe I should have been more aggressive, because I was not. I was like, is it gonna see me? Is it gonna... I, I didn't... 
I thought it was gonna attack me like in melee. I didn't realize it had a, a thing. You know, you know. So now we. There it is. Although I guess I should pull out the regular one because it. does more damage. Oh, this was not... Right on. And it's floating, so you know it's dead. Let's reload. Reload you. Cool. Oh, and there I go. I fell off the ladder. Good to know. All right, so we got blood. We got blood spatter. Blood. Is it splatter or spatter? Okay, locked. So I don't have that. Oh, hello. Uh, key card. Keypad. Whatever. I'm not going to open that yet. Or I'm not going to hack it yet. This is unlocked. I hear electricity, which seems bad. So we don't want to... Oh, hello. Ooh. Oh, that's that other wing, presumably. What is that? Potted plant? Yep. Okay. Any more greasel? Yes! Are there... Are there more than... Wait. Does it see me? Does, oh, it counts as moving. Son of a bitch. Well, in that case, I'll swim. Okay. Oh, there is another. Okay. Is that because that one saw me? Are there still more? The music. Okay, the music says no. That there's no more. Oh, and uh, baby Karkin. Well, I don't like those things, so, you know, Greasels can kill them all they want. Yeah, we'll throw a flare out. Um, did it not work because it went... Because it went out of the water? Um, alright, I guess they don't work underwater. I don't... Alright, let's... I mean, it looks like it's going. But it's not going. Alright. What do I have? Karkian Lab, I see. And right, door over there. Goals and notes. I got that tunnel code for you. Dr. Awase, project management, has cleared you to take some core samples from the area while it's being bored out. But I'd be careful anyways. Big machinery and diamond tip drill bits don't create the most friendly work environment. Access code. Okay, let's check that door then. Unless that's... No, that's probably the way forward, right? Because that was over there, so the north... Unless that's the door. I don't know. Mm hmm Well... Hmm. All right, well, let's... Let's look around again for a second. And another Greasel. That's right. Ah, there's the sealed door. Okay. Okay, assault rifle. Yeah, this thing helps a little bit with the light. It's not super great, but, you know, if we get close, it'll work. 
Man, I'm gonna open this door and there's gonna be like something in there, isn't it? Hmm. Maybe. What is this? It's a hatch. A hazmat suit. All right. Hmm. Oh, it's so dark. Wait! It goes outside. I don't like that. I'm gonna... To be honest, the ocean kind of freaks me out a little bit. Thassalophobia, or whatever you want to call it, I suppose. Because it's like, you don't know what's... You don't know what's out there. This one is locked. Oh, right on. Okay. Take the medkit. What is with this table? It's just a table. Okay. That's part of the reason, the uh, the fear of the ocean or whatever. It's not fear, well, kind of. It's the fear of the unknown. You know, what lies beneath. It's like, you don't know. You don't know what's out there. Yep. Don't forget to breathe. Uh, 5690. The other thing is, recover the schematic. So if they... If Helios and Paige have access to my systems, as soon as I get the schematic, they're going to know what it is, right? 5690. Yeah. Another Greasel? Hard to say. Should I have taken the hazmat suit? Probably. And that's where we're going. Oh. I swallowed that like half wrong. Ooh. Whoa. Could have been worse. <clears throat> Dead greasels. Yeesh. Okay, this looks like I could push buttons or something. <coughs> Whoa, careful you. Alright, well let's... We'll check that note out in a second. Is this gonna be more of the same? From Michelle, where are you? Hey, you sure? Where the hell are you? Been trying to raise you guys for the last hour. No one answers. Not on the hard line, not on the squelch. If you get this message, respond ASAP. Let us know the situation. Intruder alarms are going off up here. Another, probably another security drill. It's really turning into one of those days. Egon. Mm hmm. Corporal Hutchins, this place has gone to hell and it's all Ridley's fault. I've been able to track him. It looks like he's heading for the dock. He must have a URV scheduled to pick him up. There's no way I'm going to let him get away, not after what he's done. Grab some firepower and hole up wherever you can. An extraction team is bound to show up sooner or later. If you run in trouble, bypass security with the Ocean Guard login and Kraken password. But I don't know how much longer that'll work. Right. Stop. 
stay back from the electricity. Electricity is dangerous. <coughs> so is this... It's strange that it just automatically shuts on you. Hmm. But yeah, the whole Thassalophobia thing was the reason I got a, um, Subnautica in the first place. I was basically like, I want to get over my fear. Of course, it didn't really help, because that game is terrifying. You never, I assume we're going to come into contact with actual Karkians. Not just baby ones. Not just dead ones, either. But Aquaria is another... Hey, that's kind of cool. Now we'll use a flare. Now that it's dry. Uh... Hang on. Yeah, all right. Oh. Hello. Is that a baby? What is that? Um, I mean, we probably should do something about it. Man, that thing is going to come for me really fast. Do I want to? Maybe I could just go the other way. But I want to... Oh, and there's more. Wait, are those greasels? Those are greasels. What is that? That is probably a Karkian. Uh, it's got four legs, so that's what I would say. Can I sneak up on it? There's two of them. Can I sneak up on both? Okay. Whoa. Sneaky, sneaky. That is good. That was luck. Uh, just coming across this way and finding, finding them. Now those guys... How do I... Can I go from behind? I'm gonna try. Because those guys are kinda hidden over there. Wow, they didn't even pop out, because I, I came this way. Right, and you could see one of them. The fact that it didn't come after me. Yeah. And they're hiding on the other side of that. Oh, I guess I should just jump up there. Can I? Can I? Son of a bitch, I bet I can't. I could just shoot him with like a rocket. That would certainly work. Oh, maybe they're facing a different direction. Uh. That one's facing that way, but... I bet if I shoot this one, they, they will both aggro. That would be my... Suspicion. Uh, let's do white phosphorus. Okay, it's on fire, but that's acceptable. And is it dead? 
Is it still alive? What's going on? It's still alive. Come on, man, just die. Is it gonna die? Is it. What's. Oh, it lit the barrels on fire. Well. Where did it go? Is it still alive? I mean, it's not. Oh, is that the body? I think that's the body. Ooh. Yep, that's right on. We'll switch back to the regular ammo. Just because I believe the blast radius is... Uh, where is it? Uh, it doesn't say. At least not on there. I, I bet if we actually check out the, the ammo, it'll... It'll tell us. Okay. Which means... Maybe there's a... Maybe there's a door that we can pick here somewhere. Hmm. Does this go where we want to go? I don't know. But we'll save over this. I felt like that was... Felt like that was good. That was good overall. Man, we're almost out of time. I mean, you know. That's a big Karkian. Is there another one over there on that side? Oh crap! Oh crap! No! No, no! Whoa! 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 I, uh, am toast. My legs are busted and my torso is almost dead as well. Oh no, 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 no. Um... Wow. Well, okay. So am I, am I, you know, like fully crouched? Well, tell you what. Super stingy, I understand. Crew module access. I bet you could pick it also. Man, and that, that thing took like, what, three hits with the... The sword? Recoil. Talk to me about really? Well, okay. Everything that I can upgrade has been upgraded. That thing is way tougher and more dangerous, presumably, than those others. What does this do? Danger high voltage. Oh. Well, all right. Uh, you cannot turn it back on. Or off. Oh, it's... Okay, it just goes off after a while. It makes sense. Makes sense because you turn it on and then lure the dudes into it. And then, uh, you're good. Right. I was like, man... I hate the dark. No, I didn't say close. Ah. Uh. Alright, well, ooh, no. Darkness is bad. Let's, uh, we're gonna kind of sneak, sneak down here. I'm gonna get frickin' killed. Presumably. I'm gonna walk into another frickin' Karkian. All right. More ladders. 
I don't... Oh, no. Is that water? No, that's maybe dry. I don't see... Wait, what was that? Pipes? Okay. I'm just paranoid. I'm paranoid. Why haven't the turrets... Well, I was going to say why haven't they killed all the Karkians, but... You know. That one's unlocked. That one's unlocked. Uh, yeah. Uh, hello. Uh, wait, do I have the thing open? Yes, I do. Okay. Well. Right, now this. So, what do I do about this? Do I shoot it with a rocket? Honestly, that's probably the best idea. Right? I mean, just shoot it there. That way you don't have to worry about it. Get far back enough. Okay. It is now on fire, which is good. Oh, I guarantee it's not dead. No, it's not. Do I do I shoot it again? Hopefully that still does damage. That worked. I like that a lot better. White phosphorus for the win. Yeah, that thing. You don't want to mess around with that. Right, Manny? Where are you going? Where are you where are you trying to go? Do you want to get in my lap? What are we doing? I know it's time to stop. Just about. You want to get in my lap? I'm going to have to get up in like 10 minutes to get myself another beverage. Another adult beverage, Manny. Well, okay. If you want to get in my lap, that is totally acceptable. All right. Yep. You're a baby. All right. Well, that... I actually don't mind that. Right. And now we... Kind of know. I wish I could shank somebody with a key. You know? Right. That's kind of funny. I open it and the thing's standing there, you know, ready for me. So, we got to do something about that before we stop. More dead greasels. Do I just... I guess I just shank it with the laser sword. Okay, well, you got me. Good job, you dick. Oh, still? God. Wow, that's hurt. That hurts. That hurts a lot. What was I at, 60? Damn, dude. That's basically a death sentence. We'll do this. I don't like Riesel's, man. I just wish the... Excuse me. The, uh... I mean, poison is bad. Poison is bad. Yeah, I have plenty of lockpicks. I'm probably just gonna blow it up, though. Let's read the book. Universal Constructor Theory of Principles and Practice by Wayne Yin. And thus arose the need for a more generalized theory encompassing a universal constructor, UC, that would be able to handle such arbitrarily complex nanoscale design problems. Unlike the simple atom by atom nanotech constructors common today, a UC would combine millions upon millions of atoms in a parallel process that could produce materials or mechanisms of unmatched intricacy on a scale currently not possible even with the best nanoscale foundry. That's right. Hmm. Yeah. 
One of the most obvious... Ugh. Okay, that's cat hair. I was, yeah. One of the most obvious applications of a UC, if its, if it's construction were even practical, would be the genetic manipulation of life forms at the atomic level to cure disease, correct congenital defects, or expand their capabilities in beneficial ways. Theoretically, if an intelligent, real-time control program were developed for the UC, then autonomous artificial nanoscale organisms could be assembled. Careful design could create organisms that might actually exist in symbiosis with other life. However, UC also creates the tangible threat of a gray goo scenario, the design of an organism that is so evolutionary advanced as to overwhelm the current ecosystem. I didn't realize that's what the gray goo meant. But anyway. I wonder if I could do it right in the middle. Well. Open. Oh, right on. It got both. Okay. Reload. Pepper gun. A drop. Oh, time. Gotta stop. Gotta stop. Soon. Soon. Reload. Um. Let's do you. Because I may shoot more greasels and, you know. Take the flare, take the med kit. Manny, you are adorable. Alright, what's next? Is this another. Hmm. I don't see a greasel in here. It doesn't mean there's not one. Schrodinger's greasel. Well. Let's use my, uh, one of my skeleton keys. I do like explosives. I like ex it destroyed the plant. That's no good. <laughs> darts, tranquilizer darts. Don't need cigarettes. We'll take the liquor. Devour all the food. And I'm thirsty. I need to drink more water. Just in, I mean, today, you know. Use two points. Why does soy heal me for five? But booze, which is, well, nutritional value, I suppose. And then soda. Soda's like pure sugar. Soda heals the same as booze. That's no good. Candy bar, we'll take it. Bioelectric cell, it's fine. Why can't I eat the binoculars? I'm partially machine, you know. <sighs> All right, let's uh, let's drop down here. Figure out what the deal is. Hopefully, don't die to more greasels. Oh, we're gonna fall there for a second. There's a turret. Did I disable this one? I'm pretty sure it's active still. And the camera... Camera does not appear to be active. I think the turret that I shut off was the one that was trying to shoot me, so that one's probably still active. We will save. Oh, I'm on the ladder. Greasel ambush. Just for the record, I don't, I don't think what uh, Carson was saying about the pepper spray is a troll. I'm pretty sure it's legit. I have no idea, but you know, I don't want to. 
you know, he's a good guy. He's he's rooting for me and been fairly helpful. Try, trying to helpful. I'm kind of, you know, a little bit ahead. Uh, he said something about the skull, which I feel like maybe... I mean, I don't think it's a spoiler, but, you know, it's, it's one of those things. It's like I want to find everything. I don't, I don't want spoilers, by the way. Don't, don't spoil stuff, but, you know, uh, there was like, I think I, I don't remember if I said this already. I was watching the playthrough of, uh, Christopher Odd doing Portal 2, and I guess people told him ahead of time, like, hey, when you go into this test chamber, look over in this area for like a, a Easter egg. And Easter eggs are fine, you know, because that stuff's cool. Uh, but spoilers and all that stuff, like, oh, don't forget to look under the bed for the hidden thing like that. Mm, probably prefer not to know about that stuff, I guess. Easter eggs are fine. You know, hidden caches of ammo and other stuff, maybe not. Turret does not appear to be shooting me at this time. Why not? Strange. I don't think I disabled it. Maybe I did. Locked. Do I have a key? I do. Oh, is it another, uh... Oh, right on. Ballistic armor? Thermoptic camo. Well, I have both, and I haven't... I probably should have used... I know, I don't want to stop. I don't want to stop. Another greasel in here, Karkian. Hmm, maybe not. We'll take more ammo. Weapon mod, laser. Not you. Drop. Let's see if... Uh, nope. Okay. That's fine. And what about this? Bullets. Soy food. I will eat the soy. And... Right, there's the book. Man who's Thursday. I don't think I've read this one. I think, said Dr. Bull with precision, I'm lying in bed at number 217 Peabody Buildings and that I shall soon wake up with a jump, or if that's not it, I think I'm sitting in a small cushion cell in Hanwell that the doctor can't make much of a case, but if you want to know what I th what I don't think, I'll tell you. I don't think what you think. I don't think, and I shall never think, that the mass of ordinary men are a pack of dirty modern thinkers. No, sir, I'm a Democrat, and I don't believe that Sunday could convert one average Navy or counterjumper. No, I may be mad, but humanity isn't. Syme turned his bright blue eyes on Bull with an earnestness which he did not commonly make clear. You are a very fine fellow, he said. You can believe in a sanity which is not merely your sanity. And you're right enough about humanity, about peasants and people like that jolly old innkeeper. But you're not right about Renard. I suspected him from the first. He's rationalistic, and what's worse, he's rich. When duty and religion are really destroyed, it will be by the ri rich. Interesting. Well... Okay, let us save and stop here for good this time. Or, you know, for this time. Whatever. Uh, that is it for today, guys. Thank you guys so much for your time and attention. I really do appreciate it. I really hope you guys are enjoying these episodes. Um, what is your guys' unique positive moment for today? For me, it's just the fact that I was able to get out of work early and, and take a nap. It's been, um, it's been some long, long, long early days lately. So I haven't ended haven't really been sleeping super great. There's been thunderstorms and stuff at night. And uh, the kitties want to walk on me also. So, uh, you know, not not great sleep, but the nap helped a little bit. So that is my unique positive moment. Hopefully your guys is just as good, if not better. Hopefully better, of course. And I hope to see you guys next time. Till then, guys, take care. <laughs>